Here is the uh, trajectory that I draw after analyzing the reference movie of the bouncing ball. I also make sure to uh, find the position of each one of the key poses of the ball in this case. I want to animate a coin. So this is my setup from my uh, animation. I'm going to select the uh, application, stop motion. I want to create a new project. Uh, I want to make sure the uh, frame rate per second is 24. Remember, have the 24 have to line with the yellow line. Um, I'm not going to use any fade. I want to make sure the aspect ratio is 16 by 9, that is HD. We're not going to use any foreground, neither filter. I want to make sure I'm filming HD. And I'm gonna put it, I'm gonna put it to play back. Uh, I'm using the um, my headphone so I don't need to touch the phone. And uh, let's start. So I noticed that here is a starting frame two. So remember what um, animated in twos mean that one would take two pictures for each one of the position. So the first one um, is going to be without the coin. One, two. And now we make sure that we start here. There it is. A little bit of the a coin in frame two. Okay, in position two. Make sure we have a good framing. One, two. Then the next one I look up is a little down here. I can see the previous position there and this is the new uh, position. I can compare with my uh, drawing on the top. Uh, one, two. I want to do number four. A little more separated than before. Than the previous one. One, two. And number five is really a big, big space. Okay. We can rotate this a little if we want. So, five. One, two. Now, number six is when it's touching the um, the ground a little here, but it's only gonna be one uh, shot because I want this to be quick, so only one, one, and then I'm gonna observe the space in number seven. There is more space here, okay? So the previous one and the new position one, two. Number eight. There. One, two. Number nine is losing um, strength. It's losing speed. Speed. One, two. Number ten. And realize that my frame is smaller than the one on top, so I want to change a little bit the animation. Number here, I want to make it almost on top. One, two. Three, four. I'm creating a holding pose there. Six. 
and it's going down so it's going to start going faster only one and start moving up okay let's see how we play I'm gonna go for that here and we play it The important thing is the coin has to look that it has weight. So that is very important to keep the whole pose and to make the coin fall faster. And as always, uh, we go here, okay, done, go here, and we go select, and we're gonna export as a movie and uh, let's see i had to look for more box and uh, all files animation um homework class one class exercise bouncing ball okay choose this folder and upload and then you can change, as I said before, change, as I said before, the name of the file from box.